After being banned for the last couple of years due to taking a banned substance unknowingly, Simona Halep has won her appeal to come back and play tennis in a reduced sentence, which means that she will be able to play very, very shortly and keeps her career alive. Let's go have a look at what's happened over the last 24 hours because she has won her appeal and she'll be able to come back and play tennis soon. So this is what she had to say after winning her appeal. Today marks a pivotal moment as the tribunal has rendered its verdict, affirming my stance and bringing clarity in this chapter. In a unanimous decision, the tribunal has cleared me of any wrongdoing regarding the blood doping allegations. It was also unanimously determined that the unfortunate incident of the Roxadastat positive test stemmed from inadvertent supplement contamination, leading to a reduced sanction of nine months. Furthermore, the tribunal has directed ITI to compensate me with $20,000. In the midst of this challenging journey, my unwavering belief in the integrity of the truth and the principles of justice has been my beacon. Despite facing daunting accusations and formidable opposition, my spirit remained buoyant, anchored in my unwavering conviction of being a clean athlete. This ordeal has been a testament to resilience and the triumph of truth is a bittersweet vindication that, albeit delayed, is immensely gratifying. I extend my heartfelt gratitude to my legal team, whose steadfast faith and exceptional dedication have been instrumental in navigating through these turbulent times. Equally, my sponsors, loyal fans, and some commendable competitors have been my pillars of strength, offering unwavering support and solidarity. The overwhelming backing from so many Romanians has also fortified my resolve, enabling me to champion this cause to a rightful and honorable conclusion. Looking forward, I'm eager to turn this page and rejoin the tour with renewed vigor and an invigorated spirit. With love and gratitude, Simona. There you have it. Simona Halep is back and it's reduced to nine months. So when she got provisionally suspended back in 2022, October 2022, the nine months was from that date. So she's allowed to play in Miami. I mean, she could play in Indian Wells if she had gotten a wild card a couple of days ago. So it's a bit of a shame that it sort of happened as Indian Wells has come out, but she can play in Miami. Most likely, I would say that she's going to probably start on the clay. I don't think she's going to play one hard court event and then go play uh, the clay court season. So, I, I mean, I'd be a bit surprised if she comes back next week or the week after, but she is back and she has been found not guilty. She is innocent. And that's such a great story. You know, she's been from the start, been innocent from the start, saying she's been innocent. People have come to her defense, her old coaches, you know, Darren Kale has come to her defense. Other competitors have come to her defense and now she is allowed to play as of tomorrow. I mean, she can go play challenges next week if she really, really wants to. So Simona Halep is back and that's such a great thing to see. But let me know down in the comments below. What do you think about this whole situation? Simona Halep, she is back in tennis and she can play as soon as she wants to.